right, so a number of people, as in more than one person, has asked me whether or not a Lenko LS50 or even an LS40 is a good record player to buy, and I'll just go over a few thoughts that I've had. So most people, when they're buying these things, they're like, it's a good budget um, thing to start off with, you know, I was just entering the market and whatever, and like, that's great, encourage that my first record player was a shitty Crosley, and like, here we are. Um, but in Australia, these things are like easily over 200 bucks, so like, they're not even that cheap, and like, you know, it's better than your Crosley one, but they're also not fantastic, so, um, yeah, but let's get into that. So pretty much it's just like a clone of a um, Chinese mass-produced um, Skywin, I think the factory is. Um, and like, you know, it's not the worst. It's not going to destroy your records unless someone's dropped it in the box and the counterweight's all out of whack and whatever and your needle's a bit fucked. But really, not the end of the world. It's a nice, you know, it's a turntable. It will play your records. It's got a counterweight. It shouldn't damage your records. It might if you like put something on it to like shove it down but also very poor quality control on these things um, so you could get one that's perfectly tuned to spec and you could also just get one that's gonna scratch everything to shit so like you can win you can lose um, for 200 bucks I probably uh, would avoid it if you can find it secondhand for 50 bucks fuck it just do it it's fine you'll be fine sorry I've just got an email um, but really, you can get like an Audio Technica um, LP120 for the same price secondhand that you can get some of these new in Australia. So like, obviously, I'm talking from an Australian perspective, but um, yeah, if you can do, if you can get a secondhand good record player, probably do that. Spend that little bit extra um, if it's if you're up to like you know 200 Australian. But look. It's not the end of the world. Um, I've seen some stories of these guys having pretty bad like grounding issues with a little buzz. Anything with built-in speakers is not going to be the best for you. So just avoid it. If it's got built-in speakers, just no thanks. Um, look, if it's got built-in speakers, you got it for 20 bucks, 50 bucks, whatever. Chuck some external speakers on, play it. You'll be fine. It's fine. It's a record player. Just do it. It's cool. It's fun. Um, but yeah, look, really, it's okay. It's not the end of the world if you get one. It's not the end of the world if you don't get one. Get a nice one though if you can. But also, I recognize that, you know, record players are bloody expensive and that's also fine. Nothing you can do about that. Just have fun. Anyways, that's really all from me. Let me know if you have any questions about anything. Have fun. Bye.